Hi everyone, it's Muriel. I am here with a design team project for Craft Supplies 1 that I want to share with you. In my design team package for the month of May, I was given, sent, excuse me, some of these large safety pins. I love these. I remember these being used on um, these little, uh, we used to call them kulaks, and I think Lydia, Triple Dog Dare You Can give me an amen on kulaks if you remember what they were so they were we had them in every color corduroy and they were like a short pair short but they had this little skirt that kind of flapped over the front so you didn't see the the shorts it just looks like a skirt kind of thing but again they were called kulaks and this pin was the pin my mother would use to keep that flap closed mm -hmm. so that it didn't fly open and show that you were wearing shorts, right? So when I saw these in my package, I was so excited. I said, I, I have to alter them. And I've just been, um, you know, ideas going, 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 going in my head. So I did come up with um, some ways that they can be altered. So if you do like these, I encourage you to go over to Craft Supplies 1 and pick yourself up some. This is the large, but I know that there are medium and small as well. So the first one I made, I pulled out some charms that I purchased at Michael's. These are the Race for the Cure um, beads. I don't know if you can see the ribbon here, but that is the uh, breast cancer um, uh, you know, symbol with the pink ribbon. I have a uh, bird cage here from Craft Supplies One, a pink gingham uh, ribbon, and then these beads. And you can get these beads at uh, Michaels, or you can purchase them at Joann's. They are. Um, I threw away. I'm so sorry. The um, package that they came in, but they're in a section by themselves, and they're beautiful. Uh, glass beads, and again, these happen to have the uh, be the uh, race for the cure um, type of bead. So that was the one there, and that would look adorable on a project. And then the second one I made are for those who like to bowl. So um, here is a bowling pin and a bowling ball that I purchased from Ben Franklin some time ago. I believe these are um, charms by a company named Joker, and this is a, a large bead from my stash, and you recall these uh, white um, acrylic little uh, embellishments that have words on them, so this word says laugh, and then on the opposite side it says sweet, which is something I say when I bowl, you know, I get the... Um, I knock them all the pins down and I go sweet so um, that came to mind when I created this one here so again another um, cute uh, charm to go onto a project especially if you're doing a page of someone bowling or anything like that that would be something that can be used and then the third one I made um, has a bit of um, uh, well, I'll let you decide, kind of a um, disco ball here. So we have this black piece of ribbon, and there is a fan from um, Craft Supplies 1. The acrylic piece here says dance on one side, and uh, there is a beautiful bead from Joann's. It looks like a disco ball, and then two others, black and silver. And the other side of this says happy. So I think these are really adorable. They will look good on your mini albums. They'll look great on your uh, altered boxes or even uh, on a card or a layout. So those are my three charms that I created. Again, these are the large safety pins that you can pick up at Craft Supplies 1. There's also medium and small, and they just open up just like this. And um, you can either decorate that side or that side. You can hang the charm from the end like I did here, add a ribbon or whatever you like. You can probably put a big flower to cover up that end. 
so the um, ideas are, um, you know, just uh, a multitude of ideas. If you have other kind of charms that signify something in your life, they will be good to add on to these safety pins as well. So that is my design team project, and I'm glad that you all are um, um, here to uh, see what I made, and if you have any comments, please do leave me a message um, in the description box. Take care, and have a good evening. Bye now.